All right, this presentation is covering agriculture in Florida. Okay, Florida's role in agriculture and some general information. Florida is the most southeastern state in the United States and it has a tropical climate. Because of how versatile the climate is, Florida can grow a large variety of unique crops which can be exported worldwide. This includes tomatoes, citrus, sugarcane, peppers, cotton, watermelons, peanuts, cucumbers, potatoes, timber, and more. The population of Florida is 21 million out of the 328 million people in the U.S. Agriculture in the U.S. is responsible for 5.5% of the country's gross domestic product at around $1.109 trillion. Some natural resources in Florida and their effects on agriculture. So, forests make up 19% of the state and there was a forest fire that broke out after Hurricane Michael and the timber industry was negatively affected because of that. The forests uh, provide eco the ecosystem service of keeping the Florida air cleaner. Florida also has a mining industry which mines for phosphate primarily. Also, the vast majority of the nitrogen and the phosphate in the country, in the state, goes back into agriculture as a fertilizer. As you can see in the diagram on the right side, that's where all of the phosphate and the nitrogen of Florida go back in. So it's mostly farmland, mostly going back into farming. <clears throat> Florida is also a huge fishing state. It's sometimes referred to as the fishing capital of the world and has the largest fishing industry in the United States. Florida has several freshwater bodies of water which can assist in growing crops and the state has 16.65% of arable land. So Florida's agricultural practices Florida law allows farmers to produce crops using fertilizer under the condition that consumers are made fully aware of this process. In Florida's climate, they typically have dry seasons. During this, irrigation is allowed to keep crops fertile. One lake this is done from is Okeechobee. Many Florida farms are in an orchard style. Tilling is done, but not encouraged by the government for growing crops so as not to increase the erosion of the soil. Florida farmers are able to practice crop rotation, and some even rotate their crops three times a year. And farming equipment and large industrial machinery is used to increase the production process of certain crops, like as you can see in that picture on the right. All right, I believe that is all.